Well, hello there and welcome back to a brand new video where today's video, guys, is super exciting because we have an unexpected patch update from the guys over at Rugby25. Yes, that is right. We have another interim patch. It's not a full major patch. However, this interim patch is rather big in itself. It's You could almost maybe tease it as a, a major update. And they've actually addressed quite a few things in this update. So if you've been watching my videos over the last few days or so, once again, guys, thank you so much for all the support. Like, you guys are going crazy. Like, it, honestly, it's amazing. And just, I, I honestly thank you so much. Honestly, it means the world to me. And so many of you guys have been watching those videos and leaving comments and suggestions, etc. I don't know if Big Ant Studios have seen those videos because there's been a lot of things which I've addressed during those videos in terms of like, why is it not doing this? This needs to be improved. This needs to be improved, etc. Well, in this interim update, I'm not saying that I was the main person to kind of encourage them with this update. But with this interim update, there is a lot of things which I've addressed, which are fixed in this. And I'm eager to try this out. So anyway, let's head over to Steam and take a look. So First things first, let's continue my update. So it's around about, I think it was like a 10 gig update or so. Um, you can see I've, I played the game for like for five hours. I'm hoping to get the, the, you know, the hours up, you know, I'm trying to get to play more and more, you know, you know, time. Like I said, when this game first came out, I was in Austria for the F1. So um, yeah, it looks around about 11, maybe, maybe a total of 13, 14 gigabytes. So it's quite a big update, quite a big update. And if we, and it says small update, they have a regular update and a small update. Now if we click here, here we have access to Early Access 4, Interim Update. So it says here, hi everyone, a new update is now available in Rugby25. Thanks everyone for their feedback on the last update. So the first thing says they've improved support runners, right? So support runner positions find themselves more aggressively to keep up with the line breaks, which I think should be good. Um, my only worry is every so often we have these updates and I'm like, you've told us there was an update, but I haven't really seen um, much of it. So I'm hoping to see this happens. I mean, my main concern is the scrum half. The scrum half's always in the changing room when he should be at the, you know, at the breakdown. But uh, but that would be interesting. They've improved kicking systems. So this should be interesting. So the system for in-play kicks have been improved, including better AI targeting kicks when attempting a 50-22 kick. Now, to be honest, in the last few videos, we've definitely seen teams who are 50-22 against me. So uh, I guess it's kind of a nice to have. It's kind of interesting to see, you know, what will happen here? What will they bring? And all all that stuff uh general gameplay improvement so it includes resolving a case where players would be invisible during a ruck okay i haven't had that i have had a glitch though but where we can't just get pushing them all until uh what was it until the end of the basically the dead ball line um but it says that they've resolved an issue where players will be invisible during a ruck they've also improved ai decision making after rocks and malls now i'm hoping is that the ai in terms of the people i control or is that the opposition because most of the people i can't control they're just running all over the shop literally so maybe that will make an improvement there and they've also resolved a reported case of incorrect offside calls and minor passing tweaks interesting um improved graphics so they've adjusted overall visuals including player market replays camera clipping and further work in progress improvement to the overall graphical fidelity uh improved ui wow this is like, this is like a this is a minor update to them but it definitely feels like a major update um so they've adjusted the overall visuals, including player markers, replays, camera clipping, and further work, which is cool. I think I just said that. Apologies. I'm just so excited. Uh, improved UI. So they've a general polish to the players, the team, and the logo creators. They've also resolved some reported issues, improved the UI, and they've also cleaned it up. And once again, they've improved stability, re resolved reported set piece, not progressing issues. So there we go, guys. This here is the latest update. The game is still £25. The question is, you know, you know, a lot of you guys ask me, like, Matt, should I buy the game now? You know, we've got all these updates coming out. Personally, I think it's really down to you guys if you want to buy the game right now. Personally, for me, I cannot wait for it to be on the PS5. I'm just more of a console player than a PC player. But that's why I'm using a controller on the PC is fine. But I just find that, like, you know, just overall setup and the gameplay might be a little bit smoother when it comes to, to console. Um, but £25, I think, is still a great game. I think right now, 
they fix a lot of things i think you know there's so many teams you can play as it's honestly remarkable i don't know when the price is going up that is a question people will ask me is matt when is the price going up for rugby 25 and i don't know i mean i don't know is it is this it might be the early access price only and then that's one point they'll let us know but i imagine if you remember like minecraft for example it was so cheap to begin with and then eventually it became a full game took many many years but then you know it was a full price um but here we go guys is the latest patch update early access for intro update pretty big expect some gameplay this week so make sure you subscribe to the channel but anyway if you have enjoyed today's video then be sure to massive thumbs up subscribe if you know regarding this but anyway guys thank you guys for watching and as was in my next video adios chaps boom